And so we pulled into the parking garage at Mary Bridge and I got out, went around to her side. She got out, stood there, and then she just said, oh, mama, and she claps in my arms. There were some good Samaritans walking up to their car and um, I screamed for help. And they rushed down and um, they pulled her off of me. And at that moment, she had blood coming out of her nose. Um, I called my husband and he was already en route because he had a bad feeling after we left. Um, and uh, at one point, the doctors turned and they said that they were going to call her at 10.05 and I, I couldn't really believe that that was, they were going to do that. And they got another pulse. And this, I thought things were going to be okay. And they eventually moved, moved us up to ICU and I thought, okay, that's going to be an okay thing. You know, and they had an owner on a ventilator. Um, they worked very, very hard to try and save her. And it's done. She, she was fading. You, I could tell... Uh, and then at 12.23, she passed away. Um, she had no more eye, eye movement. I, I cuddled with her for over three hours. She was my baby. Another little hat done. A lot of people don't think that they can die from the flu. I know exactly what my daughter was going through, um, and uh, it was it was really horrible, horrible to be sick like that. We tried 12 years to have a child, and so she was an in vitro child, and she was everything that we were supposed to have. And then the Lord blessed us with this our son two and a half years later, and they were best friends. Um, so my son lost his best friend too, and it's been really hard for us. Um, yeah.